Next, we will crochet the small leaves. For this part, we will use lemon yellow yarn with a 2.0 mm hook. Let's go through each round in detail. First, we start with a foundation chain. Wrap the yarn around your finger, passing it over your pinky finger and then over your index finger. Hold the loop with your thumb and middle finger. Now, let's make the chain stitches. Place the hook on the side of your palm, fold the yarn over the hook as shown, and pull the middle yarn through, creating an adjustable knot. Insert the hook into the adjustable knot and tighten the loop. Yarn over and pull through the loop to form a chain stitch. Continue this action until you have 12 chain stitches. After completing the chain stitches, skip the last chain stitch. Start crocheting together with the wire from the second to last stitch. Crochet one single crochet stitch. Then one half double crochet stitch. Let's demonstrate the half double crochet stitch. Yarn over. Insert the hook into the stitch. Yarn over again and pull through. Now you should see three loops on the hook. Yarn over and pull through all three loops at once. This completes one half double crochet stitch. Next, in the following stitch, crochet one double crochet stitch and one picot stitch with two chain stitches. Let's demonstrate the double crochet stitch. Yarn over, insert the hook into the stitch. Yarn over again and pull through. You should see three loops on the hook. Yarn over and pull through the first two loops, leaving two loops on the hook. Yarn over again and pull through the remaining two loops. This completes one double crochet stitch. Now, in the same stitch, crochet a picot stitch with two chain stitches. First, crochet two chain stitches, then insert the hook into the front loop of the first chain stitch. Yarn over and pull through the loop. This completes one picot stitch with two chain stitches. Continue with the pattern as follows. One double crochet stitch. One half double crochet stitch. In the next stitch, crochet one double crochet stitch. And one picot stitch with two chain stitches. One double crochet stitch. One half double crochet stitch. In the next stitch, crochet one half double crochet stitch and one picot stitch with two chain stitches. 
one single crochet stitch. In the next stitch, crochet two single crochet stitches. and one picot stitch with two chain stitches. One single crochet stitch. One single crochet stitch. In the next stitch, crochet one half double crochet stitch. And one picot stitch with two chain stitches. One half double crochet stitch. One double crochet stitch. In the next stitch, crochet one double crochet stitch. And one picot stitch with two chain stitches. One half double crochet stitch. One double crochet stitch. In the next stitch, crochet one double crochet stitch. And one picot stitch with two chain stitches. One half double crochet stitch. One single crochet stitch. Remove the stitch marker and make a slip stitch to complete the round. After finishing the round, leave a 5 inch tail. Cut the yarn and end. Use the reserved yarn to twist two wires together. And secure them with a glue stick. Wait for assembly.
The small leaf is now complete. You need to make a total of two small leaves. Please complete the other one on your own.